the video shows how to calculate the clock and output frequency of a TSPC D flip flop in Cadence Virtuoso. The design of a TSPC D flip flop is already designed with GPDK 45 nanometer technology. It is a single clock which is used to achieve low power design. Once the design is completed, check and save the design. Then go to create cell view from cell view to create the symbol. Click on OK. Set the ground pin to bottom. Click on OK. Rearrange the symbol or you can use as it is. Let me change this. D at the top. If you want, you can change the symbol of this to have a clock. Then place it. Adjust the ground. And you can provide the name. Instance name as D flip flop. Symbol creation is done. Now I want to perform the verification of this symbol. For that, create a new cell. This is the design name which I have used. Call it as test. Get the instance of the design. into the work area then provide the D input and clock I'll copy from this design Label this input and this one is the clock. Connect this D input. Use two capacitors. One 
one for Q and the second one for Q bar. And you can name Q, Q bar, Q, Q bar. Provide the ground as well as VDC, DC supply. Design is completed. Rename them with D followed by clock. Check and save the design. Design is completed. Once this is done, go to the launch ADL transient analysis of 30 nano. I want to plot only the clock and the output Q. Only two signals. Netlist and run. Now I want to calculate the frequency of the clock and the frequency of the Q signal. So let us calculate the clock frequency first. Select the clock, then click on calculator. In the functions, you have frequency. frequency. You can click on send buffer expression or you can evaluate the. So this is the frequency of the clock. In a similar manner, you can obtain the frequency of this output. Select the signal, click on calculator, then search for frequency you can add it to the adl window then click on evaluate so this is the frequency of the output q so if you want you can see that the frequencies of Q and Q bar. Rerun the simulation. So the clock frequency is 500 megahertz. Which is this one, 500 megahertz. Here it is given the value and the frequency of the Q, this one, it is 166.67 megahertz. In this way, you can calculate the frequency of any sequential 
सर्क्यूट 